Hey guys, it's JD from Ponzel World, and today we're unboxing and reviewing these gaming earbuds made by EXA. Now you can find these on their website, links for these will be in the description below, and they are currently listed for $50. So let's go ahead and start with showing you around the box here. You can see here on the front, EXA, little picture of what it looks like, GT1 True Wireless Gaming Earbuds. On the side here, a couple of things right there. Then on the back here, we have some specs, 500 milliamp battery built into a charging case. And then in the actual headphones is 50 milliamps right there. You can see EXA GT1. So let's go ahead and open this up. I'll actually show you guys around the box real quick, real quickly again, in case you're wanting to see anything. So uh, let's go ahead and open it up here. It is covered in uh, heat shrink. Let's go ahead and get that open here. Go set that off to the side and let's go ahead and open the box. All right, so you pull this little sleeve off of the box here and then let's go ahead and open it up here. It's actually magnetic, pretty cool. And here they are, they're kind of crooked, but I mean, there they are. Let's go ahead and get this little bit off here. Take the actual headphones out. Here they are, little case, actually smaller than what I was expecting. Looks pretty cool. And there they are. Sweet. I'll probably need to give these a charge, which it should come with a charger. I'm interested to see if it's USB-C or not. Hopefully it is. Let's go and see here. Got some extra ear tips too. That's pretty cool. And this is actually USB-C. Sweet. Happy to see that. You also have a user manual right there. So let's go and give it a charge and go ahead and try it out. All right, so I went ahead and gave these earbuds a listen, and so far, I'm actually pretty happy with them. Uh, let's go ahead and go over the first important thing, which is, of course, sound quality. Um, overall, sound quality is, in my opinion, actually pretty decent. Um, has a decent amount of bass. Um, the only real complaint, I guess, that you could say I have is that they, don't get me wrong, they do get loud, but they're not, for example, as loud as my Apple AirPods, for example. Now, AirPods are way, way more extensive than these. Uh, however, uh, they just don't get all too terribly loud. They're plenty sufficient, uh, but sometimes, you know, like, for example, with my AirPods, when I'm, like, vacuuming a car or something, I really need my music to be up loud so then I could hear it. Um, these just simply don't get all that loud. Um, other than that, though, they do seem pretty good. Um, if you typically like having your, you know, your music down lower or like when you're playing games, you know, having a sound uh, down lower, um, these will be totally fine for that. But if you really want to crank it up, uh, they just don't get all that terribly loud. Um, again, other than that, I'm pretty happy with them. Again, overall sound quality is pretty good. Um, you can see here, open the case. Here they are. Right there. I already gave them a charge. Got some cool lights on the front right there. Overall, again, I am pretty happy with them so far. Uh, so there it is. All right, so there it was, a quick little unboxing and review on the X uh, earbuds here. Uh, now I do wanna show you guys the instruction manual here and basically the different functions of the earbuds. So it's gonna start off over here. You can see this is how to power them on or off manually right there, or you could clear the pairing too in case you want to pair it to a different device. Uh, right here, you could tap twice to switch in between music and game mode, and then you could also uh, tap once to play and, uh, play and pause your music, or tap it three times for your voice assistant. Right over here, it's how to take a phone call right there. You could answer a call, reject it, or end the call too. Uh, pretty cool. You can see there's how to charge it. Of course, you just, you know, pretty much plug the cord in and then there you go. It's charging. Um, you can see here, you can also tell the charge indicator from the front of the, um, the case right here where those blue lights are right here. It's going to wake them up here, take them in and out. And there you go. There's your charge indicator right there. Uh, so far, I'm liking these things a lot. They do definitely sound pretty all right. Like I mentioned, and they look pretty cool too. I really like this little case, very small. Um, also USB-C is very, very handy. I'm liking to see uh, USB-C a lot more than micro USB. It's just much more superior. 
uh, in my opinion. Uh, so there it is, pretty cool so far. I'm really liking these earbuds. If you're in the market for, of course, some gaming earbuds, or if you even want some earbuds just for, you know, listening listening to music, I do definitely recommend these here. So yeah, I guess that's really it for this video. Hope everybody enjoyed, and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.